Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another video. Today we will be exploring how to automatically boot into Windows when starting up your computer without having to type in your password every single time you log into your computer. This is being performed on a Windows 10 computer. It should work on Windows 8 and there is a slowly modified way to do this for Windows Vista and 7 which I'll talk about later in this video. So pretty much when you're booting up your computer normally after you're done loading the BIOS you're brought to the screen that you have to enter a password in order to get onto your account and not only will this increase the time it takes to start up your computer but it's also an inconvenience to the user. You have to continuously type in your password every time you restart the computer. And if this is a personal computer and it is in a secure enough location that you don't feel the need that you need to have a password every time you log into the computer, this would be something of use to you. Okay, so we're gonna go through this step by step. So right now we're just gonna log into our Windows account here. The username is test machine, but it will be different obviously depending on your computer. What we're going to do uh, right now, since we're on Windows 10, what we're going to do is we're going to right click on the start button down here, click on run. Now I already have this in here, but you have to type control, now put a space, and then user passwords 2. And then you'll click OK on that and then we'll have a user accounts page come up on the screen right here now we see that this is check marks that says users must enter a username and password to use this computer now you have to keep in mind that this will log in whichever account you select automatically so just be careful of that if you're using multiple accounts on the computer I mean you could still log out of whichever account you decide to log in automatically to access the other accounts but just this should be more geared towards a one account user. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to uncheck this users must enter username and password. I'm going to click on apply here and now you have to enter your password so just type in your password right here. Click OK. Now we click OK and if we restart the computer Okay, and we can see that we have booted back into Windows and we did not have to enter a password when logging in. Now you could also access the user accounts on Windows 7 or earlier versions of Windows by just typing in user accounts and then you can go through the same process that we went through in this video. But I hope that this helped you out guys. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.